Today I'm working on this uh, home like Ching saw. It's a 45cc saw. It's a uh, model Timberman 45. Anyways, I started it up and it's uh, revving really high and really lean. So I'm going to adjust the carburetor. First, I'm going to take off this cover. Now, once you get the cover off, you want to remove this boot here. And here are the screws. There's plastic covers on them. Now, to remove these plastic covers, you have to go in and spread the clip here, the white clip. What this will do is allow you to pull out the screw cover. There's one. There we go. Now usually this is the low screw and this is the high screw. And this is your idle adjustment screw here. So first you would adjust your carburetor, then turn this in to make it idle faster or turn it out to make it idle slower. So the way I'm going to adjust this carburetor is by starting the saw, I'm going to rev it full throttle and I'm going to play with the screws either by going in or out until the saw runs at its best performance. So I'm going to do that for both screws. If it runs lean, I'm going to unscrew the L screw. If it runs too rich, I'm going to screw it in slowly, all at the same time listening to the engine to hear it run at its best. So it seems to run not too bad. I've got this screw here set at a turn and three quarters out and this one to a turn and three quarters out. I had to readjust the idle screw and I put a spring in it as well because it kept uh, an adjusting itself. It's kind of hard sometimes to get these saws running really really good because it's not the same quality as a husky or steel but you just do the best you can. It's kind of like the Poulan saws. So what I usually do once I've set them is I let them cool down and then do a cold start on them again just to see how they start. Once you've adjusted your carb you can uh, reinsert these uh, bushings or inserts here and just pop them in by pushing in. Don't forget to put this boot back on here, it goes like that. And the last thing to do is just put your cover back on and screw that down and you're done.